Bosch, how come our two human bosses always give in to your demand? It comes with years of practice. Hey, I think we need to iron out the differences in our mindsets regarding the two humans. Yes, boss. Firstly, I'm your boss. I lead and you follow. Sure, boss. Secondly, the two humans are just our partners. They are not our bosses. Please stop calling them our human bosses. But boss, they feed us. So? Don't we have to remember their kindness? By all means, you can remember their kindness. But it's still a relationship of transaction between us and them. They feed us while we provide them with countless hours of entertainment. Please spare me the irks of hearing them being called human bosses again. Yes, boss. Arnie, what are you thinking? Nothing, boss. No, 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 nothing. Well then, let me teach you how to get the two humans to bring you to the botanic garden for your walk. Oh, boss. Yes, please. First, you must understand the human psychology. What are the things that motivate them to do things for us? Yes, boss. There are four reasons humans want to walk their dogs. To let them empty bowels, sniff at things for mental stimulation, exercise and training. There is also socialization for both dogs and humans because of these walks. However, our two humans don't care about these reasons. They are only motivated by two other reasons to walk you. What are they, boss? Firstly, the two humans are interested in showing off to the other humans. In this case, they would want to show off the pedigree of the dog they own. Secondly, they like to be amused. So you must act ridiculously cute to amuse them so much so that they must take you out for a walk even when they are too lazy to do so. Am I a pedigree dog? Obviously you're not. They did walk me quite regularly in the past. Well, that was when they still have people to boast to about your being rescued from the shelter by them. Now every dog owner who walks their dogs at Botanic Garden have had enough of them and are avoiding them like the plague. That is why, nowadays, Lawrence and Joe suddenly take you out for a walk there. What shall I do then? Well, the only option for you is to be super cute in front of the two humans. Am I not cute enough? I have to be honest with you. No, you're not cute at all! Boss, what shall I do to be cute? First, let's try to present the leash to the humans with a real big green. Like this? Yes. But try to green wider. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on, you can do better than that. Mm -hmm. Boss, I can't green and hold on to the leash at the same time. Oh gosh, I guess you'll need to put on the ultimate crown of cuteness. Boss, are you sure this will work? I'm pretty sure this will work. 70% of the Singapore citizens are impressed by the leader because he exudes absolute cuteness by acting like a clown. Alright now, start shaking your head a bit. Yes, slightly more vigorous now. Yes, work it, work it, work it!